Okay, I'm good. Welcome back to the end zone. Area teams trying to advance to practice Thanksgiving morning and play on Black Friday or Super Saturday. Huge thanks to Fuddruckers on Slide Road for feeding us. They have been amazing for years. Scores on the ticker. Back to the highlights. Still division, a 2A Division One. Farwell taking on Sonora and Snyder. Broncos with the ball. Jamie Butron dropping back, finding Cam Aguirre. Dropping it in for the bread basket for the end zone. They go for two. They're up eight nothing. Broncos still with the ball. It's uh, the fake in the handoff. Biltron taking it in. 16 nothing. Sonora. Farwell trying to make something happen out in Snyder. They're going to throw the deep ball here. Looking for Wyatt, Wyatt Shearer. He'll get the pass interference call. That would end the first quarter. But the next play, Steer's going to punch it in with just an awesome dude. Corey Stancil gets the touchdown, but Sonora gets the win, 42-14. Up next, either number six, Hawley or Panhandle out at Lowry Field tonight. 6-0 Bearcats, Panhandle finding Landon Durst, getting creative, taking it across the field. The two-point try would be good after the touchdown. A Panhandle went up 8-6. Bearcats, though, back the other way. Landon Sakura going to show off his speed. Going untouched for Hawley. Throw up that final score. You got Hawley getting the win, 59 to 16. Number three, New Home. Number 10, Sunray. Sunray up 21 0 in the third. Caleb Cook trying to connect with Colby Cook in the end zone. Dawson Bennett breaking it up. The ball goes back to the Bobcats. Clock ticking for New Home. Trick play. Logan Addison going to be picked off here by Kagan Davis. And it leads to a QB keeper from Armando Lujan here. And Sunray went up 28-0. Less than five minutes to play. New home getting on the board. Caleb calling his own number. But it's the only score of the night. Under his unexpected exit for number three, New Home. They fall to Sunray, 28-7. Taps, Trinity Christian at Grace Prep. Down 15-7, Trinity Christian's Eli Reeves. Going to find Benjamin Bruce, double B with the yeah, touchdown. Was, Cutting it to 15-14. Later in the second, Eli Reeves, the keeper. This kid better get some offers. He is outstanding. Trinity goes up 24-22. Fourth quarter, Trinity up 30. 31-22, Reeves to Josh Marrero. Marrero's got some speed if he can get by that defender, and he does, and he's gone. 69 yards, Trinity Christian wins it, 41-22. They're in the Tap State semifinals. Love it, Christian. And Brazos Christian in Brownwood, Battle of Eagles. Eagles score first, Brazos Christian. Cooper Muir, Muir gets in, 7-0. Eagles of Lubbock Christian answer. Luke Lee swinging it over to the left to Brady Simmons. He'll go 30 yards, two-point conversion good. 8-7, Lubbock Christian. Later, Lee going to swing it this time right to Simmons. And it's the same result from the same distance. Another 30-yard touchdown, another two-point conversion. Defending state champion Lubbock Christian wins it. 58 to 7. Six man. Number five, Borden County. Number six, Whiteface in Slayton. Coyote Ball, Coda Bigham, finding Ishmael Rodriguez, and he is off for the guys from Gale. Eight nothing BC. Whiteface Ball, if you blink, you miss him. Ethan Kaufman turning on the Jets. It's 16 8, Borden County. Rodriguez then looking and lobbing to Jeremiah Rendon. He's in the end zone. It's 22-8 BC. Rodriguez, just the star of the show on the night. Here he'll roll into the end zone. The Coyotes of Borden County hand white face their first loss. 65-50, Borden County wins, and they advance on and head to the regional semis. Number 11, Spring Lake Earth. Number seven, Miami. First quarter, Miami. Fourth and 15, Hayden Thompson. Skying it out, finding Micah Hinshaw. Miami on the board, 6-0. Then Spring Lake Earth answering. J.J. Harmillo breaking tackles, dodging folks. He's going to go the long run. Spring Lake Earth taking the lead. This game out in Matador. They trade scores, third quarter. Wolverines down six. Froilin going the run here. He'll get across the plane. We're back tied at 34 in the fourth. 20 seconds left. Warrior Thompson, the Warriors Thompson, finding Luke Wheeler. He's going to get in for the touchdown, and the Wolverines fall to Miami, 42-34. Up next, either number two, Knox City, 
Or number 10, Happy, out in Petersburg. Happy, coached by Motley County, Stacy Perriman. Striking first, Joey Blackman gets the TD run. Cowboys of Happy knock off number two, Knox City, 62-34. They get Miami. We got number three, uh, Klondike. Number five, Whit Harrell. Panthers trailing 36-8. Broiling Kennedy rolling out. Finding Brett Robinson, the Panthers battling back. The Cougars looking to extend. Jared Quintanilla dancing his way into the end zone. Klondike gets the 64-16 win over Whit Harrell. Also tonight, Jayton beat Strawn 58-12. They get number one Benjamin, who won 112-78. Playoffs heating up. Seminole, the end zone team of the week. We'll be back next week. Love you guys. Woo!